Thanks for joining us. I'm Christina Gesford. We start tonight with an update on a four alarm fire in Lindenville that destroyed a daycare earlier this evening. I speak with a witness who details what he saw. When I first walked up, it looked like only one house was on fire and it looked like it was completely totaled. NVU Linden senior Quinlan Pierce tells me he was leaving campus Monday afternoon when he saw billowing smoke painting the blue sky gray. He soon arrived to find fire crews showering not one, but two buildings with fountains of water. Sparks first flew just before 4 p.m. Monday at this house with the red roof here on Charles Street, parallel to Broad Street through the woods behind Greg's Auto. Several fire departments descended upon the scene. Gail Galvin tells Channel 3 News her truck caught fire and the flames jumped to her home. Gail, the owner, uh, said that everyone on her street had come up and talked to her already and offered an immense amount of help. Strong winds carried the blaze south to the right onto the metal roof of this white structure, which houses Stay and Play Daycare Center. A crowd of onlookers lining the sidewalks as rivers of runoff flowed down the asphalt towards neighboring homes, their power cut. They were all outside in their lawns, sitting on their porches, watching on. Everyone escaped both structures, including the Galvin's two dogs and cat. Piers tells me when he drove by during the cleanup around nine, crews were tearing down Galvin's house. Lindenville Fire says Charles Street is closed to through traffic tonight and crews will remain on scene overnight to monitor hotspots 